I was raised in a good family home and setting and was baptized as a child. We went to church most Sundays, the six of us. With three older sisters and a busy mom and dad, I was searching for attention and found it in a neighbor. This led to a significant abuse of trauma that lasted 14 years and sent me down a wrong path for 25 years. I met my wife when I was 25 years old, and it was true love at first sight. I knew after the second date she was the woman for me, kind, gentle, trustworthy, and loving, just what I needed for my soulmate. We married in February 1993, and it is a loving marriage, and I would do anything for her to make her happy and pleased. The early years of trauma had formed me in ways that I needed to keep secrets, lies to protect both my family and myself. It was all about self-image, and all needed to be perfect to be accepted and loved. When things did not go well, I would self-blame and be quick to anger. We have three wonderful children, a son 20, a daughter 19, and a son 17. We moved to Guelph in 1999 and discovered Lakeside Church. We felt connected to Lakeside and we got involved in the children's ministry as helpers on Sunday mornings and I joined a few committees at the church and this lasted several years. Our lives and our children's lives as they grew older got busier and Sunday church services got further and further apart where we were only going a few times a year. We have had several significant traumas in our marriage, one being my wife got very sick after the birth of our third child and it took months to recover. Two years later, I was in an accident. It took a year to recover and walk again. Through all of this, I continued the lies and continued to control my own life. It was 25 years for me to drop to my knees and pray to God, enough is enough. I give my life over to you. God, take the wheel. The next morning, I picked up the Bible and started to read the New Testament. That was a year and a half ago. It has been an amazing year and a half on my journey with God and what He has done in my life. I am slower to anger, stop the lies, I am more patient, and I am more loving of others and myself. In my journey, the number one thing I learned is God forgives all my sins and wrongdoings and truly loves me. I continue to study the Bible every day with my quiet time with God and I have a few great mentors that I can confide in and help me with my journey. I was led to celebrate recovery six months ago at Lakeside, and this has been a great addition to my journey with God and my recovery. God has spoken to me very clear on several occasions in my journey, and one was to communicate to my wife about my childhood trauma. I spoke to my wife that morning and it was like a huge rock and pressure came off my life. She was so loving and understanding and this strengthened our relationship even more. Having God in charge of my life and a continued growing relationship with Him has been the greatest gift in my journey. My journey has just begun. I am here today to be baptized in my new relationship and life with God.